start by putting my name on here, Mr. Wood. Then I am going to paint. And in this case, I'm just going to use a variety of colors. I'm going to get a little bit of purple on there. This is just to make a nice, sort of colorful background. Next, what I'm going to do is screen print. I'm going to set aside my paper, I'm going to put it on the screen, I'm going to open that up. I'm going to put my paper on top of my screen, on top of my board, I'm going to put a stencil on top of my paper. I want to line it up where I want my rocket ship to go. I'm going to put the screen on top of that. The screen is going to hold my stencil in place. And now I'm going to scoop out some ink to put onto my screen. And I use a squeegee to spread the ink. I don't need to cover the entire screen, I need to cover my whole stencil. And there are benefits to covering a smaller area. Um, aside from the fact that it wastes less ink, it gives me an idea when I pull this up of where my stencil is going to be and where to line up my next paper. If it looks smooth like this, that's a bad sign that the ink is just sliding around on top. When I drag it, I should be able to see the contours of my stencil, my design, so that I know it's going through. And now when I peel this up, I have a pretty nice design. And this paper is ready to go to the drying rack.